Drop the gun! Show me your hands! Since January 1st of this year, at least 23 children and teenagers have been fatally shot in the state of Georgia, showing a tragic trend of shooters and victims getting younger. Here are their stories. In Stone Mountain, Georgia, 19-year-old Jace Sandria Pirtle was fatally shot by 21-year-old Malachi Coleman on New Year's Day. On January 3rd, in Jonesboro, Georgia, 18-year-old Quentin Morris, with the lovely face and neck tattoos, was fatally shot by 17-year-old Malik Moses. On January 7th, in Columbus, Georgia, just did a video at this place, 17-year-old Juan Carlos Rivera was found by police fatally shot at an apartment building. On January 10th, in Macon, Georgia, 15-year-old Ashton Roberts was fatally shot by 57-year-old Algie Bryant outside a marijuana grow house. On January 10th, in Decatur, Georgia, 18-year-old Akir Muhammad was shot while walking out of a gas station while others were attempting to rob the place. His mother says he was studying to be an electrician. On January 12th, 13-year-old Ariana Moye was killed by her 17-year-old brother, Anthony Mincy, different last names. She survived for two weeks in the hospital before she died from a gunshot wound to the neck. On January 21st, in Atlanta, 13-year-old Deshaun DuBose was shot and killed in a parking lot of a skating rink. On February 1st, again in Atlanta, 15-year-old Lloyd Foster died after an exchange of gunfire with another teen. On February 2nd, in Milledgeville, 18-year-old Zai Havier was fatally shot when these two thugs killed him during a home invasion. On February 4th, in LaGrange, Georgia, 15-year-old Quindarius Woodyard was fatally shot during a shootout outside a grocery store. Police don't know if he was a bystander or part of the shootout. On February 7th, in Moultrie, Georgia, 19-year-old Zykavian Porter was fatally shot by another 19-year-old, Jason Don Ho. On Valentine's Day, 13-year-old Jaden Travis was fatally shot on the street in front of his father's house in Norcross, Georgia. The next day, back in Columbus, 16-year-old Demarcus Fajan was fatally shot. On February 18th, also in Columbus, 19-year-old Michael Carter Jr. was fatally shot at a Motel 6. On February 19th, again in Columbus, 15-year-old Leonardo Luke was fatally shot in the city's fifth homicide of the year and fourth of a teenager. On February 21st, in Peachtree City, 15-year-old Madison Jeshuin was fatally shot in her home by these three thugs. On February 23rd, in Macon, Georgia, 19-year-old Camarian Manor was fatally shot in Macon's Bird City neighborhood. On February 28th, in Lawrenceville, 16-year-old Jose Martinez was found fatally shot behind a home. 20-year-old Denris Calzadilla was arrested for the murder. On March 5th, 15-year-old Samuel Moon and 14-year-old Ajane Hill were shot at a house party near Douglasville with over 100 teens celebrating a sweet 16 birthday. On March 4th in LaGrange, Georgia, second teen from this city, 16-year-old Nasir Truitt was fatally shot. On March 6th in Milledgeville, second one from this city on this list, 10-year-old Demarion Bird was fatally shot while sleeping. I covered this one. And on March 8th, 17-year-old Kingsley Gibbs was killed in a shootout in Madison, Georgia. You didn't have to pay too close of attention to see a trend in the victims. And I may have just realized what the true meaning of white privilege is. It means you are privileged in not having to be senselessly killed 
by someone of your own race. Which saying that will fill my comments with people calling me the R word. But the visual evidence is clear. Now, 23 homicides in one state is not a lot. But that amounts to around one teenager or younger being fatally shot every three days. And that can't be ignored. And it's possible I missed some, and there may have been more than 23. With the way the judicial system is these days, this trend of teens killing teens is not going to slow down anytime soon. So stay safe, America. Keep your head on a swivel and remember, a bullet can travel over a mile unimpeded. So keep dodging those strays till these shooters get better aim.